Good morning. Welcome back. Easy. We're in the lower 60s right now, upper 50s in some locations, so it's cooler outside than you might be expecting, especially after a hot last week. You know, as we move through the rest of the day, temperatures are going to once again reach the same heights that they have. That means upper 80s, close to 90 degrees, but it is not going to be as uncomfortable outside. You have to do any outdoor work. You have to do anything outside for a long period of time. It's going to feel much better today, despite the fact that our temperatures are still going to be in a higher than normal place. Now you you can see our storm tracker. We have clear conditions now. We have dry conditions and we're going to stay that way as we move through the day. And you can see on our morning drive forecast, the mostly sunny conditions are going to continue for these next several hours. Now I want to point out our temperatures are going to stay at a lower place for a longer period of time and we are much less humid compared to the last couple of days. So if you have to do anything outside, you're much more comfortable for a longer period of time this morning than you have been. You can see we're only in the mid 70s by nine and our temperatures by mid to late morning are going to stay in the 70s. So if you need to get outside, you're looking for comfortable weather this morning should do it. But again, this is why it feels so much better. The dew point is so much lower and the dew point is just a number we use to measure how comfortable it is outside, how much moisture is in the air. And you can see we're uh, we were at sticky. We were at 70 degrees with our dew point last week. Uh, the, today we're right around 60, so it's going to feel much better outside. Still just a little bit muggy in the mid, by the end of the afternoon, but for most of the day you're going to feel much better. And you can see our future cast here showing the most clear sky continue as we move through the rest of the morning and early afternoon. So this is around lunchtime. Again, if you need to get outside, you can't get outside till later in the day. Temperatures are going to be a little bit higher, but you can see we're mostly sunny and dry, and we're not going to have the threat of the pop up showers, thunder showers that we had over the course of the weekend due to the low humidity. And again, it just feels better outside. Temperatures upper 80s though by the end of the afternoon. So if you are still sensitive to high temperatures. Might be a little uncomfortable for you toward the end of the day, but you have less humidity. It's going to be more comfortable for the most part. And as we move through the rest of the night, early morning tomorrow, expect a repeat. Only difference is it's going to be much cooler throughout the day tomorrow. Temperatures, instead of being closer to 90, are going to be closer to 80. We're in the mid to 80s, lower 80s in some locations as we move through tomorrow afternoon. You can see some clouds trying to bubble up here farther out to the east, but you can see the chance of rain very, very small, mostly outside of the Wabash Valley to the southeast. So if you're looking for dry weather these next couple of afternoons, you're not going to have the same threat of pop up thunderstorms that you had over the course of the weekend. Now today we're in the upper 80s again, mostly sunny, still very hot in the afternoon, less humid though, so just a little bit more comfortable despite being warm. Now tonight we're right around 60. We're mostly clear and again, temperatures are going to drop to a low level as we move through the overnight compared to the last several mornings. We're going to be around 60 degrees this morning. We're in the upper 50s right around 60 degrees. Tomorrow we're in the mid 80s. Clouds are going to move in as we move through the day. You saw that on the future cast mostly to the east in Indiana, but you do have a risk for some partly cloudy skies toward the end of the day. But I, I want to point out our temperatures. They're in a lower spot mid 80s and you can see our temperatures staying in a lower spot closer to normal for this part of the year Wednesday and Thursday. And as we get closer to the first day of summer, we're going to see mostly sunny skies and a chance of showers, thunder showers on Friday.